Hi guys, I'm Yuchi. I'm Chu. Um, today we decided to do a video about like UBC for your student guide kind of thing. And yeah, so here we are with our UBC Thunderbird shirt. Sure. If you're wondering, our mascot is Thunderbird. That's why our shirt yeah. says Thunderbird with and the bird on top. Yeah, this is a huge shirt because we bought it for a homecoming game. It was free. <laughs> That's the main point. <laughs> so I guess the first question would be like, why do we pick UBC? Um, well, personally, I picked UBC because I had lots of family in Vancouver. Also because it's one of the common schools Alice and I had together, and we also wanted to be able to experience college together. Elaborate on that. He went to USC, Marshall, but he chose not to go. Stop. <laughs> so... You got an NYU, okay. Okay, but that's different. And then we just decided to come here together with our family support to experience a college life together. And plus, we both yeah. really, really like UBC over the schools, other schools we got to, so... Not, we not adding hate on the other schools, it's just personal, personal preferences. Here we are. Yeah. First of all, you guys are going to receive like the package that says Jumpstart, I would say, including your... What was that? It could be on email as well, but it will be like a newsletter. Right. Yeah. Like some introduction on UBC and other important things that for you guys to expect. Yeah, but Jumpstart, you have to come. You have to go. Like, okay, I know it's like expensive, mm -hmm. but trust me, you have to go. Hey, 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 hey. Yuchi, why do I want to go to Jumpstart? All right, student. Here, listen <laughs> up. Anyways, so Jumpstart is a program that, oh my gosh, what should I say? Okay, this is too official. Let me just say it in my way. It's just a program that you should go. It's like a great place to make friends and to have fun and yeah. basically experience the dorm life even if you're not planning to dorm during the school year. Because you're still going to be assigned a dorm in Jumpstart and you'll right. meet lots of people Actually, there. Actually, that's a good point. I forgot yeah. about that. And then also, it happens like before school starts, so it's like two weeks program, I would say. It's about two to, two, two to three weeks, and then it includes some classes, which gets you like some experience on what the professors expect you, mm -hmm. and you get assigned in a group with people that's mostly taking the similar classes with you, so that's really nice because you might see them in the classroom as well, which also really helps because a lot of lectures are like 500 students here. And do not skip yeah. those activities. <laughs> a lot of my friends, including myself, sometimes skip, but don't skip because you're going to be friends, trust me. If you really put yourself out there during gym, sir, you will make at least one friend yourself. No, I'm just kidding. You will make friends. If you do want to skip, however, like those um, mobility workshops, like maybe you already got your phone already, don't buy, there's no point in going. But always go. Careful. Maybe UBC is watching this video and be like, this kid. <laughs> mm -mm. <laughs> but you can go to every single activity, including the things you probably have done. Maybe not. Banking mobility. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, they are pretty useful, I do have to say. Jobs are people, they really put in a lot of effort into it, so try to show them some love and support. <laughs> yep. Alright, and then third job start, people, your group leader. What do we call them again? Like orientation, orientation leaders. Orientation leaders, yes. OLs. OLs. Yeah. So they're gonna definitely bring you to a common spot in UBC. It's called Rec Beach. So Rec Beach is a really friendly, I guess you would say, open environment because it's a nudist beach. So you're not mandatory to go nude there, but there's a lot of people that do as well to explore like being one with nature. And it's definitely experience, part of a first year experience and first experience. there's always like events happening there. So mm -hmm. it's always a nice place to check out when you come because that'll Just be kidding. when like the sunny weather and before Vancouver rains and oh, it becomes yeah. depressing. I don't go at least once, I would say, just to experience the culture there, but it is a lot of stair steps. Oh no. So, yep. think that through. I've personally probably only gone like twice in my entire first year, so yeah, I mean, I'm kind of lazy and I want to work out, so. Ugh. But don't worry, if you attend Jumpstart, your LLs will most likely bring you there. Like 90% possibly. Oh yeah, don't skip. Just, just go there at least that one time. Yeah. You'll have fun the first time, yes. 
All right, so let's talk about a little bit of housing. So I know some people before they come to UBC, you're asked to choose housing, yeah. like preferences, if you do choose to live in dorms, which I really strongly, strongly, strongly suggest you to do it, at least in person. Personally, I know a lot of people want to get in single connected. I mean, it makes sense. It's it nice to get your own bathroom and everything. But honestly speaking, communal is not too bad. Mm. If it's it, in an orchard. I mean, no, sorry, no. if it's in totem. No, no. Here. If you get good floor mates. Fine, that's true as well. Last, my floor mates are all pretty nice. So I would say my entire total experience was pretty good. So, yeah. Mm, basically, the four first year's housings are Toda, Baini, Orchard Commons, and Ritsumaiken. Most people, when they just come to UBC, they're going to prefer Orchard as first because it is like a hotel, I have to say. It is a hotel, but then like the problem with Orchard is a lot of people say, a lot of my friends say like it's not as socializing. Mm -hmm. So you'll find yourself socializing with people outside of Orchard more. Mm -hmm. But of course, like there's still a lot of social floors since there's like mm -hmm. 18 floors mm -hmm. in and Orchard. when you just came to UBC, your what's that RA, La Flor RA, they really put an effort into making it fit. Yeah. So if you do want to meet your floor mates, then please go to those events because you will have some fun and then you'll really get to know your floor mates. That will definitely be helpful. And you might meet some great friends because like after school, oh, yeah. when you go back to dorms and you want to chill, mm -hmm. there is all the first people that come to mind is always like your floor mates as well. Mm -hmm. I'm going to put in some of my friends video link below for room tour. So go check them out. Okay, so let's talk about the weather in my favorite <laughs> An interesting topic here. Um, right now the weather is perfect. Summers are perfect. Summer, spring-ish, they're both yeah. perfect. Fall, I would say, is also quite nice. But yes, this statement is true. Seventy percent is rain. Yeah. <laughs> It will get depressing. It will get depressing. But yeah. you should always like look into other stuff to like, I guess, see the beauty in rain because you'll see it every single. Day. But it doesn't rain. snow that much here, so that's oh, a yeah, positive thing here. Mm -hmm. And it won't use. It usually won't get too cold. The weather is usually like. It's I'm, cold. It's not negative something though. True. Yeah, never past negative ten for sure. Oh yeah, no, no, no. That's yeah. that's Toronto. <laughs> if you're into cold weather. Toronto, unlike you, it's all for you. Otherwise, summer is wonderful. You'll love it here. The sun is up at 5 a.m. and sets in 10 p.m. It is really, really beautiful right yeah. now. And during the spring, it's beautiful because there's lots of cherry blossoms. <gasps> nice Instagram pictures. Yeah. Go check the Instagram out and then you guys will see how beautiful they are. I think that's all I've got for first year. But you guys said what's comment below and then ask us more questions, throw in messages, and then yeah. We'll reply in our next video. Yep. So that's it. Sounds good. Yes. And then like. And subscribe. Yes. Eee. Oh, and share it to friends that you think might come to UBC. And we look forward to seeing you.